You're watching the Comcast Network. CN100, Chicago. Facing elimination in game four of the NLCS, down three games to nothing, the Chicago Cubs turned to Jake Arrieta, and he did not disappoint, striking out nine Dodgers in six and two-third innings of one-run ball. Javier Baez added two solo home runs, and the Cubs survive game four. The marquee doesn't lie. Cubs win this one by a score of three to two. He needed to pitch as deeply as he did for us to get that win tonight. Um, you know, good for him. He... Um, Stayed with them as long as I thought we could. And then, uh, you know, Brian Dunsing has been outstanding all season, gets Bellinger to pop up. But I thought the movement was spectacular from Jake's pitches tonight. You knew a guy like that. He's going to go out there and compete um, in an elimination game. He's going to leave it all out there. And that's exactly what he did. Um, got him 210 pitches, and he left it all out there. Uh, kept us off balance, made pitches when he needed to. Um, the sinker was moving. Um, he had the curveball working today, um, throwing it for a strike and then down below the zone when he needed to and kept a lot of our lefties at bay. Um, we had some good at-bats against him but really couldn't break through and it, it's just a credit to him. He made pitches when he needed to. You know, since this, this series before, I've been trying to get a base hit so hard and, you know, tonight um, I just say to myself not to try too much and, and I did and there you have it. I had two good contact and, you know, win the game by, by one run. I mean, it's a very talented group. They, they really are. They're the world champs. Um, and you know they're going to fight to the end. So uh, today they did. They, we got beat today, and it was – I think the thing is that you can't win them all. Um, you're not going to win them all. But I think that it's uh, – you feel better that – I thought we pitched, pitched well. I thought we competed in our at-bats. Um, but we got beat tonight, and that's going to happen. And, I mean, I was upset. I mean, listen – this, this is a, 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 an elimination game, man. This isn't just another one. This isn't June 23rd. This is an elimination game. And, again, with all due respect to the umpires, and as Ricky Bobby once said, once you've said with all due respect, then you can say whatever you want. <laughs> whatever, with, with all due respect, under those circumstances, that can't happen. It can't happen. If Granderson is the next pitch out of the ballpark, that can't happen. I wouldn't say that the pressure is on us. I think that we're in a pretty good spot. Um, we've got our number one pitcher going tomorrow, and um, we've got uh, two of the guys at the back end um, rested. Um, but, you know, I can't speak to their mindset, but um, I, I still like the position we're in. Great to have this win, because if not, we were going home tomorrow. But, um, you know, we, I feel like we're still not in track. As, as a team, but um, you know, I think if, if we get if we get back in track, um, everybody as a team, we we're gonna be the best again. We have to uh, elevate our our game uh, offensively. It's just, it's just that simple. Um, it's not about maybe kind of hopefully we got to do it. How do you do that? You have to stick with your game plan. You got to be more centered. You got to be a tougher out with two strikes. Um, you got to move the baseball in situations. We're capable of doing all those things. That's what needs to occur for the next three games against Los Angeles. So the Cubs fly the W for the first time in this series as they hand the Dodgers their first loss of the postseason. The Cubs now trail by a deficit of three games to one, the same one that they faced last year against the Cleveland Indians before they came back and won their first World Series in 108 years. Game five will be a rematch of game one with Jose Quintana facing Clayton Kershaw right here at Wrigley Field. From the friendly confines for CN100 Sports, I'm Aaron Kern. For more Chicago Cubs postseason coverage, go to Xfinity On Demand, get local, all Chicago sports.